We'll yeah. see about the touch as we... Yeah, that, his raw time, Frederick, was yeah. 95.83, which would yeah. have put him in the lead. Yeah. That'd be heartbreaking if just that last little touch on the gate is going to keep him out of the final. Yeah. Now, a man who's already proven he likes this course. He won the silver medal here in 2015. Oh, yeah. At right. the World Championships. So um, he knows the course. He's proven himself on it. Can he put down a run today for the Polish team? Matthew Polizic. Looks really good so far. He kept the speed really nice over Piccadilly. That's the, the big stopper in the beginning. And yeah, nice spin there, keeping the speed, getting a little bit stuck in the way, but managed to stay close to the up. So yeah, I think he will still be up on the split. Yeah. He, uh, he won a bronze in the World Championships way back in 2013 as well. So he's twice picked up minor medals at a World Championship level. Yeah, he's been really good at the World Championship. He's a, he's a big, big event performer. Yeah, he is. Rick, yep. Yeah, and managed to make the team this year. I think he has been out uh, of the team for a while. So it's good to see him back making the team. And yeah, oh, that's so fast. Really fast. So let's look at this now. He's, he's yeah. on about the same time as the Spaniard. Can yeah. He? Nice combination there, though, for the pole. Yeah. And this is he, where he's going to go direct. Yeah, that looks very good. I think. That is very nice to see. Now, can he get to the finish line under 95.96? I think very so. Close. It's going to be close, but I think we're going to have a new race leader. Yes, yeah. we are. Yes. Not a lot of emotion there. Yeah. It's hard work. It's hard.